Hi guys, Sassy Shopper here. So I wanted to show you guys some of the awesome um, Mickey ears that I have made. Um, so my friend went to Disney World and I'm so thankful she got me the limited edition rose gold sequin mini ears. Oh, you guys have no idea. I was so sad because I was, they're limited edition and I didn't think I was going to get a pair. Um, and I love them. So she totally inspired this video by bringing me these ears. I got them yesterday. I'm super excited. So let's take a look at the ones I've made. Okay guys, so this is the first set of ears I'm going to show you. And I just have them. You guys saw me haul this um, from the Dollar Tree. This is the succulent, the rocks, and that bulb. I just have them sitting on there. Um, and I have them tied with jute because they have that little thing. Um, and they're just tied so that they kind of look like they're floating. Um, but so I made these super cute ears. Um, these ones were Rapunzel inspired, as you can see. They are on a pink headband, and they are purple wire ears with some really cute um, pink flowers and purple flowers, and we have this really cute butterfly in the middle, and I also put some like yellow goldish kind of flowers because in the Rapunzel movie, um, her hair like lights up and turns gold, and the flower is like a gold flower that gives her her power. So I thought that was really super cute. Um, I'm a total Disney lover and a Disney mom. I have watched these Disney movies a hundred times. Um, and I'm just going to show you guys the back of them is flowered as well. So you don't see nothing from behind there is flowers behind as well so these are the rapunzel inspired ears and over here we have the moana ears if y'all watched my video um my last video i gave you guys like a little sneak peek of these um but this is kind of you guys saw me haul all this stuff from the dollar tree so this is just kind of like a deeper look at them um, so these ones are on a white headband. We have some yellow and orange, white and orange flowers. Of course, we have the greenery because, hello, she's an island princess. And Tafiti was all green. Um, I do have a little burlap, or not burlap, but like a ribbon bow in here because like her outfit is mostly like orange and like... Um, brown kind of it almost looks like a ribbony I don't know how to explain it um, and then I do have a seashell in here with some super cute little pearls on it because of course the ocean and as well the same flowers on the behind of it as well as the greenery on the behind of it and we have the green ears here, the green metal, um, because I thought that was the best for the colors for Moana. And I will show you guys the pair that I made my daughter. So this is the pair I made my daughter. It's quite different. Um, the headband is blue. The ribbon is white. And as you can see, these are fabric. And they are just like the ones from Disneyland that are plush. Um, I did bling out the bow a little bit. We have Anna and Elsa and then around we have some purple diamond jewels and the back is fabric as well. Um, these I made when we went on our Disney trip um, in August last year so I never got a chance to make a video for you guys. These are a super cute pair that I made my daughter and my niece actually has a matching pair. Um, another thing that I made was this really cute, I made this um, when we were on our way to go to Disneyland when we were saving. This is a piggy bank. I just took a shadow frame, I took some scrap paper and lined the back of it. And this one is the one that does have, can you can see my fingers through it, it does have a little slot in the top so it is a, like a piggy bank um, mirror. They sell these at 
Hobby Lobby for about $10. And then I did take some like stickle and make snowflakes on the inside and added some stickers and bling and added some bling on the outside. So this is the one that I made my daughter. And we are going to be saving to go to Disney World next. So you guys will be getting a couple of Disney videos coming up. And this is how we have hers. They just kind of sit in her thing. Okay guys, sorry for the glare. Um, this is like right in our hallway and next to my son's bedroom. So you can hear my kiddos playing downstairs. We made this one as well. I made the Elsa one for my daughter and I made this one for all the boys and this one just says Disney Vacation and we have some Mickey and Minnie paper and I did stickle um, inside the back of it and then we also have a um, set of like Mickey balloons and I did find these super cute ears that I attached to the back and I thought this was so cute and such a creative idea and again this is one of the frames that is like a what is it called I can't remember what it's called like a shadow box frame but they're for um, like a memory keeper frame so I did make this as well and these are just a couple of the little Disney things that I made for us to go to Disney so one more thing that I made that I thought I would jump on here and show you guys I made my daughter this gorgeous enchanted rose I love it it was actually for me and she stole it um, so I thought this was really gorgeous and it looks really gorgeous in the dark I will show you that in just a second so here is the enchanted rose in the dark I feel like this is just so gorgeous and my daughter loves it she uses it for her nightlight and it does have a battery pack so you can um, turn it on and off without touching the rose. So I hope you guys liked these DIYs. Um, and if you would like to see how to do some of them, I would be happy to show you. These are just um, a couple things that I've made that I have been so inspired by Disney. Sorry guys, my phone like went crazy. So like I was saying, these are just a couple of the things that I have made um, and I've been so inspired by Disney and I hope you will love them and hopefully you will get some amazing ideas. And like I said, if you'd like to see how I made any of them, please leave a comment below. I would be happy to remake any of them for you guys and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys!